Hello everyone, I'm Mr. Mokalover, and thank you for joining me here, of course, in Vault City in Old World Blue. So, New Reno's gone, but it's 2283. So, how did I beat New Reno? Let's talk about that first. So, uh, it's probably best if I pull this up. I made forts. Made another line of forts around here, and basically let them grind themselves on my line, throwing out some of my divisions, my robot divisions, throwing in a few of these guys, uh, you know, or puppets divisions, just because puppet divisions with infantry usually yank can't get pierced. And eventually pushed in and took out New Reno. Really, really annoying. But, um, I will apologize. Apparently there were times for encirclements that I didn't realize. I thought I could just push in there. Didn't encircle too many divisions. Did overrun like 40 of them. But, uh, yeah, that was my bad. That was my fault. But, you know what? I'm going to take this as a learning opportunity. So, a couple things to remind ourselves. Robots, they fall off. They completely fall off, uh, you know, mid to late game. And right now, I did convert a lot of my guys to robots. They were just the LR divisions, like the 10 combat with light robot divisions. I just decided to convert them. I have a massive deficit of robots right now. Uh, I want to see if I can try to use more APCs. I'm actually going to throw you guys over here. Uh, actually, you know, your combat robot. Actually, Wallace, do you have a combat? You don't have a combat robot. So you know what? You all come here then. That's not bad then. Just because APCs, it's a little different. So let's look at my division stuff before we move on. So this is what I'm using right now. If I have full supply for my robots, they have quite an awesome soft attack. Their HP is great. Organization's okay. Their breakthrough is pretty good. Their defense is horrendous for being a 35 combat with division. That's horrendous. The only reason I say that is because if you compare them to APCs, 40 combat with APCs, of course they have way less soft attack. They have a little bit less HP. They double the organization. They use half, literally half the supply. Half the supply, which is one of the problems that we have with robots. Even though they're 35 combat width, they still have half the supply of 40 combat with APCs. They still have a little bit of armor. Don't really care about armor too much for these guys. They don't have as much breakthrough, but their defense is just like roughly three times better. Probably more like a little more than two times, more two times better, but. I'm going to try probably to use more APCs, try to convert myself to APCs instead of robots. And also, yes, I do know I could convert, like, take out these two branches of heavy robot divisions, make, get it down to 20 combat width, and fill it up with APCs, which, actually, you know what, we might as well take a quick look at that. I don't have the army XP for this anymore, so uh, I'll convert you to this, APCs, APCs, APCs. So this is what it would be if I made these 40 combat with divisions with APCs and robots. So we would have a good amount of soft attack. Hard attack's okay. Air attack we've got a ton of. Defense goes skyrocketing. More than doubles it, which is awesome. We lose a little bit of breakthrough. Oh, that's 44 combat with. Hold on. Uh, It's still pretty good. Breakthrough is still pretty good. Defense is pretty awesome. Armor so is relatively decent. Reliability goes down. Gain more organization. Lose HP. So I might convert these guys to this eventually, but right now... I'm focusing more on APCs, and I know, I know, I know, a few more things. Close air support. Someone told me to use, like, the close air support version of close air support. That's why I have, you know, nuclear-powered air attack planes, which has 36 ground attack, but I do have the armored annihilator, which gives us 43 ground attack, and I would like to use it eventually. Uh, I was planning on hopefully getting rid of our deficit of close air support first, though, so we could at least use these guys first before I make armored annihilators. So we get, like, 50-ish more close air support planes, especially since I'm going to go to war with New Vegas right now. It is 2283. I have my war goal, and it expires tomorrow, March 6th. So, we have on APCs. And uh, other comments. I need some divisions that can just break through enemy lines, such as tanks, so I'm going to be focusing a lot more on tanks. Uh, I made Sentry Bot Mark IIs, which drastically gets rid of my need for circuitry, which is great. I do need more composite materials, which is okay. That's okay with me. You know what? If we need composite materials, because everything else seems to use circuitry, except for annihil armored annihilators, which kind of sucks. Regardless, um, not bad. And the last thing before we move on. Trade laws. I've already gone down to discouraged traders. I actually can't come back to discouraged traders. I actually tried it. I went to like open to traders, which reduces the amount of resources that we get already. I can't go back to this. So actually on discouraged traders, that's really good. We can't go to distressed outsiders just because we're not at war and we need economy law, every cat for the army, everybody for the war machine, which I'm already at, you know, basically 
was it what was it called war economy in vanilla so uh yeah that's pretty much it national focus is i mean obviously i could join the brotherhood of steel i don't really feel like it right now but let's go ahead so this is my army over here and i'm still having these guys train just because uh i need more army xp always need it oh one more thing dog divisions or these combat with divisions i could make them bigger but i'm going to save my political my army xp for now just so that i can alter my robot divisions just because we're out of stuff oh and yinta i finished up yinta that was actually really easy because we were at a standstill over here but crazy horns was declared war upon by yinta as well like if you crusade you get two war goals against neighbors they went to war with crazy horns which diverted their divisions away in which my puppet divisions were actually pretty easily able to just come in here and just steamroll them so whatever let's go ahead and go to war and struggle a little bit with new vegas cool but you know what? With struggling against New Reno, that was actually probably good for us. Just because it served as a reminder. It serves as one hell of a reminder that robots do fall off. So, I probably won't be able to do much here. I mean, we could try planes. <clears throat> Excuse me. I really don't think I can do much. I mean, they're getting beaten back a little bit by the West Washington? No, the Western Brotherhood. So, it is what it is. Could we win here, maybe? Maybe. I mean, they are using robots. We can't pierce them. They can kind of pierce me, which is honestly really, really disappointing. Uh, I hate it that they can pierce me. I hate it so much. Could it oh, we might be able to win, though. That's cool. There, I think there's... Hold on. So they're using a lot of light robots. They're not using... They have a few divisions using heavy robots, which yeah, I guess makes sense. Uh, Sure, we'll have a non-aggression pact. I would love to be able to come down here and kill them, but we'll see what happens... Oh, uh, you guys are just supporting the attack. I want to attack down here if possible. Or, wait, you know what? You know what? Try that. And this is all... Oh, actually, do that. Just cut all these guys off. Because we gave this territory to these guys after they helped out with the Sorrows, which was very good. Sell some outdated equipment. Also, oh, development projects. Oh, manpower. Arms were, oh, I could, yeah, let's do some of this. This will be good. Defenses are online, power armor, technology. Oh, yeah. I have plenty of caps for this. We still get, like, 72 caps a month or every quarter. That's pretty good. So, I realized <clears throat> when we were fighting, I need more military factories still. I just don't have the industry, or at least feel like I have the industry, to really do much. So, we're going to build up a lot of factories. Or as many as we possibly can. Or almost as many. Because I still want to make, you know, work on infrastructure. Infrastructure is still very important to me, but, you know, we'll see what happens. Good, 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 good. Can we win down here? They have a couple divisions that have anti-tank. Because anti-tank just shreds armor. Unless you're playing, like, the Enclave. Or maybe even the Washington Brotherhood of Steel. Odds are you're going to get pierced. Just want to win here. That's all I want. Layered air zones. Great. Uh, tanks. We've got to start going with things. I can't believe I forgot about tanks. <clears throat> My apologies about that. I should have remembered about tanks. Good. Good. Very nice. Oh, they're attacking us here. Can they pierce me? Probably. Yeah. But this isn't a good look for New Vegas. Now, I've been told by someone, one of my commenters or subscribers, take Vault 3, take New Vegas, and take Nellis Air Force Base. I'll probably do that and puppet the rest of New Vegas, which will be just a very small enclave of what it used to be, because I'll give part of this to the Western Brotherhood. So. Oh, look. An encirclement. Well, they still have victory points, which kind of sucks, but whatever. I'm going to let them starve. Our guys are hurting a little bit, but we are replacing enough numbers, maybe? Maybe not? I hope we're replacing enough. We'll take Grand Wash soon. And I'm still trying to get rid of all sorts of resistance. Because no matter what you do, or almost for most of the time... Ooh, let's change this to Spartan Outposts. They're going to have some sort of resistance, which I really hate. They're not there yet. I do have a couple of... Vault City Coffee sitting here next to me, which is great. Nope, nothing for, res for resistance yet. Actually, because I just want to core all this stuff. Eastport, I know it's not worth the manpower at all. But really, it'll be okay, probably. Uh, experience soldiers lost, eh, that's okay. Justify War Goals times, uh, that's okay, yeah. I mean, it's, it's all alright. Oh yeah, that's going to cost 260, that's fine. Let them get a little bit lower. Oh, actually, fix the plot for this guy, great. Oh, another APC division. Great. I'm going to throw you right there. And throw you right there. You know what? 
Can we try to push in, perhaps? Sounds like a fun endeavor. Send you guys in. Take a victory point so they get even less supply. That'd be awesome. Oh, they're pushing in a little bit. That's not good. Another APC. Uh, go right there. That's fine. Yeah, lots of robots. Good. Can we take half of you guys? Attack Fort Pierce. Come that way. Can you help support the attack here? Oh, look at that. We got even more army XP. Ah, oh, it's so weird seeing... So weird saying that we finally got more army XP. Usually we always have enough, but glory falls. Alright, whatever. Once they start pushing past vault... Hey, whoa, what happened down there? Holy cow. That is disgusting. Santa Ana. Maximilian. Holy cow, you just butchered Mexico. That's... Well, I guess that's pretty normal, but that's disgusting. Ah, oh, overran a few divisions. Cool. We can beat robot divisions as long as they don't have... You know, have too many heavy robots... A little disappointing, but whatever. You guys come that way, you guys come that way, you guys come that way. Just finish these guys off, because I want to finish off the other side, too. Cool, so we've lost 1,000? No, 26. Wartime administration. I think I've already read this. They get more... I don't want to lose political power. No way, man, no way. Salvage cards, great. Great war APCs. Gonna need it. Gonna have to do it. Cool, and I'm trying to do more light machine gun stuff. I want to finish these guys off. Get everyone on the border with these guys and just... There you go. Great. We have killed off 6,200. As much as the Mojave chapter has done in a much shorter amount of time. Firearms, fire teams... Uh, tar walkers, you know, they're going to raise their rel rel reliability. No, they're going to be r raising their... Um, independence factor, the autonomy states over time, so it doesn't really matter too much. Cool. Let everyone get here, because I'm going to do one hell of a push into enemy lands. Dweller Douglas, you are leading robots right now. Robotic stuff. Army max size. I know I'm going to get army max size. I like that. That'd be good. Get everyone over here. I doubt we can make it like a giant push. Hold for now. We are lacking a, a few more planes. Alright. Can we do a general push? I doubt... I sort of doubt that we can't. Oh. Where'd you guys go? What the heck? Eh. Alright, so we're doing okay. We seem to be doing okay-ish. Uh, I don't really want any more divisions like that. Because that just cost me more money. It literally cost me more money with these bottle caps. Which kind of sucks. Oh, uh, we're doing sort of okay. Oh, uh, made an encirclement. Nice. Very good. We're destroying a lot of divisions. We've killed off the most people possible. Huh. New Mariposa. Western Brotherhood of Steel. You know what? If that's a case, I'm not joining them. I might consider taking out New Mariposa with... I don't know. Or take out the Mojave Brotherhood of Steel. But Mojave Chapter. Ooh. I really hate the Super Mutants too, though. Hmm... Which one's the worst enemy right now? New Mariposa or Western Brotherhood? Western Brotherhood is pretty strong. Oh, ne never mind. They're not very strong at all. Holy, 36 divisions. What the hell are you doing? Uh, yeah, these guys definitely have to be taken out, even though they have less manpower. Um, yeah. Oh, 20 days. God dang. Yeah. That's probably worth it. Ah, New Vegas is downfall. Great! So, I'm going to split this up between me and the Mojave chapter. Oh, no. Well. Uh. They already have... They already own this stuff. I need to take vaults... I need to take this stuff for the little events. I'm going to take this for, this for the events. You know what? It's going to look terrible. It's going to look absolutely terrible. But, uh, Mojave Chapter? You can have this stuff. Because I was going to puppet the rest of this. It'll be what it'll be. Whatever. Puppet. Yeah. There you go. Cool. This is disgusting. I know it is. My apologies. I'm going to take them out eventually anyways, so it doesn't even matter. But unfortunately, I will be right back. Alright, my apologies, guys. I didn't mean to do that, but, you know, something's happened, like I said before in another video. Anyways, so, I've been thinking about this. Vault 21. So, let's take a look over here. So, now we have a couple decisions we can take with Vault Tech Calling. However, they still... I gave them Jacobstown, but, uh... Yeah, Jacobstown. I need Jacobstown. So... Right now, I'm just going to go ahead and retake this. I mean, that's why I say transfer tool mod, just in case I make mistakes like that. Now, we've got to discuss Ruby Hill. 
Should I leave him alive? I mean, there's technically Vault 21 as a nation. They're no longer New Vegas since, obviously, they don't own New Vegas. And they don't even own a Vault 21. However, they still have their production of good stuff here. So, I suppose for now, I can let them live. Because they get a lot of bonuses to robots. They obviously don't have nearly the production that they used to have, which, you know, isn't very good. But, yeah, you know, whatever. Closer support, cool. So, you know what? If they can make stuff for me... We'll let them live. They got 5,000 manpower, which is pretty cool. Almost 6,000. Holy cow. They have only a military factory. I will help them out a little bit. So, here you go. Here's some more factories for you. In time, I do want to build up all the areas here. Wow, level 10 stuff. Nice. Uh, looks, looking pretty good. I still want more military factories. More, more, more. Especially in lands that are our, co that are our cores. That would be good. Antelope preservation. We might do that as well. Oh. Yeah, they still have this little glitch thing here. Let's do that. There you go. Thank you. And we do want to go to war, of course, with New Mariposa, because they're actually pretty big. Now, the Brotherhood of Steel, ch you know, faction, they've slowly pushed into Kaisar's Legion, which is interesting that I can see all their stuff now. Oh, that's kind of cool. But we'll see how long they can hold that up, because what is Kaisar up to? I mean, oh, they just had a civil war. That's right. They just had a civil war. Which wasn't very good for them. They went with Immortal Empire. More non-core manpower, which probably helps out a little bit. Uh, Pax Burbellum. Followers influence. Majority slave workforce. They have, that's, that's not a bad number of divisions. 115. I think... Did they just finish their war? Because Kaisar's Legion is whole once again. I think they still have pulled more divisions. Because this is obviously not over 100 divisions over here. So that would be interesting to see. I do want to see the Brotherhood struggle, though. I We have to get them to struggle quite a bit. And we're still trying to justify war goals. And I know this is disgusting. This is ugly. I know, I know, I know. Whatever. It is what it is. Actually, Vault 21, you have cores on Bitter Springs, or at least claims. That's cool. Ah, uh, Robco. Robo Brains. Probably not going to use them. And we're done with the, our robotics section. Very cool. Let's grab Wasteland Cars so we can get more buffs for our vehicles. And because we capitulated New Vegas... We have like a deficit of like 5,000, 6,000 combat robots. We're looking really flipping good right now. That's awesome. Of course, we need a lot more APCs, close air support. We definitely need to help out, fix this up a little bit more. Like I said, I want to make sure that these are all 50. Basically, we need 75 more planes before I start switching to armored annihilators. And then just get rid of those guys. Follow of Zochikaloko. Flower Wars have... That's just disgusting. Mexico, please clean yourself. That's disgusting. Um, yeah. So we need a few more composite materials. That's actually okay. I don't mind supporting the eh, Steel Rangers. Why not? Um, only four at a time? Can I get more than four? Probably not. You know what, New Victoria? You're good enough. We'll, we'll trade with you. Good. More military factories would be awesome. APCs. I need to make more APCs. Protectrons. We're okay with... I don't really want to lower it too much. These do require composite materials, which we will be running out of eventually. Annihilators will be good. Rocket launchers will be good, even though we got like 6,000 in reserve. Factory-wise, I guess we could do five more here. That'd be pretty awesome. Nuclear tower, power attack planes. We'll finish that up. Then we'll put on these an armored annihilators, which will be fine. Yeah, that's good. That's good stuff. And we got another APC division. Cool. Cool. Let's see, any upgrades? Not really. Awesome. Vital targeting points, which would be cool. Up on our... AP oh, you know what? Maybe not APCs. Let's go with Scout Kits, finally. Let's finally do some Scout Kit stuff. So, it looks like they're the new Mariposa, or Troll Warren, are pushing into the Western Brotherhood. Kaisar is getting pushed back a little bit by these guys. Huh. Now, obviously, these guys... Oh, they have a peace treaty with, of course, Vault 21, which is fine. Which I'll annex them eventually. No worries about that. They have 37 divisions. Uh, Brotherhood Knights. Mostly, wow, they mostly have infantry. Holy cow, that's not good. And they have 16,000 manpower. That's pretty good. You guys have 4 manpower and 133 factories and 23 divisions, which is not too bad. And, of course, they still have the Steel Rangers, which has 75 divisions and 5,000 manpower. So it's really going to be a grind. They're on a two-front war, which is great to see. I really don't like these guys up here, though. I'm going to go to War with Kimmel Station. We have until July 15th. So we got some time. Got some time to kill. And 
I know it doesn't make a ton of sense for me to core this stuff, especially for manpower, but look at that resistance. That's terrible. That's absolutely terrible. I hate that so much. And you know what? Since we have a little bit of army XP now, I could make these bigger. Uh, but I'm going to go ahead and duplicate this. Because I will do Robo APCs. I might actually, if I do Robot APCs, I might just take off light support robots and just throw on just APCs and heavy robots. I might just do that. I don't know yet. Oh, actually, since we have that much, you guys have logistics and maintenance. Can I throw anything else on here? Doggos would hurt your armor. A little bit more breakthrough. Actually, 10 more soft attack, too. A little more HP. This doesn't help you at all. That's actually, fire teams, uh, fire teams are okay. They're not really that great anymore. I mean, they're okay. They're not bad. They're just not great. And they give you a lot of debuffs for attacking and defending in certain areas. Anti-tank. I mean, I could get you so much piercing, you would be able to pierce anybody and everyone. I think I want some anti-tank on these guys. I think that would be okay. And so let's change this up. Let's go ahead and start removing stuff. I know I don't have enough things for this. That's okay. It's totally okay. Cool. And we have until July 15th. Good. Gives us time to build more stuff up and watch enemies suffer at the hands of each other. Yeah, we definitely need more APCs. Grab maybe a little bit more. Cool. Oh, ah, see? Oh, they pump it to courtyard state, whatever. More divisions. I really don't need these guys. I'd rather just let them give me supplies. If possible, they created those divisions really quickly. Requ start lend lease. Oh, we could request garrison support. Oh, uh, sure, you got manpower? Oh, God. Dang, guys, thanks. Thanks for you guys. I appreciate it. I really do. Ah. Nope, nope. How you have. Oh, that's, that's really fast. Seven to. No, no, stop it. Stop it. Stop it. No, for love, 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 love of God, please, stop it. Oh, God, no. Come on, man. All I want is your manpower. Save your stuff for yourselves. Oh, come on. You should not be able to unrequest that or get take that back. That's stupid. No. I don't want to see this. Oh, this was such a bad idea letting him be free. I might just annex them if this keeps happening. I hate this. No, 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 no. Please stop. Are these guys training? They might be, which is fine with me. I don't really care. Yeah, all right. Less resistance, please. Thank you. Actually, let's take a quick look. Occupied states. Occupied So we still have a little bit here. Just a little bit, not too much. Outpost, outpost, wasteland. Let's go to sporadic outposts. That'll be good. Wasteland, sporadic outposts. Pretty good, pretty good, pretty good. That'd be fine. Good. Very nice. So we got some more Robco security stuff. That's okay. For now. <laughs> For now. Good. APCs are doing a lot better. Planes, close air support is doing a lot better as well. We're going to grab some tanks super soon. Making more military factories. That's awesome. Oh my god, what the heck happened? Oh, these co combat robots need so much. Oh, I need resources. That's kind of okay. I put them at the bottom, though. Still want to make some more other stuff as well. That would be actually okay to do that there. By the way, this by five, we can actually make it just a little bit more. So that'd be okay. Oh, this is so bad. I need more resources. Uh, so yeah, New Mariposa is definitely winning against these guys, but they're definitely winning against Kaisar's Legion for now, which doesn't make too much sense, honestly. Hmm. Kaisar, you are not doing very well. Oh, they got encircled here too. That's not good. Hmm. I want to see New Mariposa. You know, I'm gonna. Can I justify on them again? How long does it take? Twin oh yeah, let's do it again. I want to see the Brotherhood struggle more. Because they're definitely struggling up here. Which is great to see. What is the casualty rate right now? Legion Ranger War. Oh, let's see. 6,000, 11,000. That's not too bad so far. But New Mariposa Ranger War. 7,000. Wow. Wow, that's pretty intense. Not going to lie. That's pretty flippin' intense. Radar. We're definitely going to need some radar stations up here. Navajo Nation's Forgers. Uh, their platoons. Oh, they got anti-tank. That's not good. Tribes of Giants. Yeah, they got a lot of anti-tank. That's not good for us. Industrial support. That's fine. 
Impact bumpers, very cool. So we get more breakthrough, less max speed, whatever. Uh, we've got to wait for more stuff. That's fine. Specialized doctrines. Plain stuff. Fortress protocols. 182 days? Sure. Oh my goodness. Please stop. Exploit. Let's climb down on it. Oh, that's a lot that we need for that. Let's do this. Let's do Vault 3. How about that? So, Vault 3 is partially flooded, and the Fiend's occupation of the Vault has not helped its state. Establishing an outpost here would not be impossible, but a much easier prospect would be to repair the water purification systems for export to the rest of our settlements. We get more water. Do we need more water? We have plenty of water. Renovate the systems. Lose manpower to get a core. Cool. Yeah, we don't need more man more water. And, you know, security team, I really don't need it. As much as I like infantry, I don't really need it. So, whatever. Gun ports, very cool. Very cool. Down there. Awesome. Support stuff. Just grab some heart attacks, heart attacks. Yes. Actually, that's, not, that's really not worth it. That's really, really, really not worth it. 3% is better because you get more piercing and more heart attack, too. Yeah, 5%. Meh. Yeah, they're doing a really good job against Khazar's Legion. That's really disappointing. They're really struggling up here, which is fine with me. Yeah, this war is not going to go very well against these guys. Okay, we're going to go back to war, which is good. This gives us, just by not going to war, gives us time to build up our planes, which is incredibly important. More APCs. Combat robots will come along. I really don't want to trade for... Oh, God, no. We need more energy stuff. Mm. Plop. Plop. Try to build it up in areas that have potential. Or easily build stuff up in these areas. Actually, if I change this to construction engineering, do we get more? Yeah, we do get more power stations. 10% faster, but that's only 10%. I'd rather have the political power to get rid of resistances. Especially new Reno. Ooh. Lovelock, 265. 304 wasteland cars. Awesome. Military cars, it is. At some point, the Mojave chapter cannot keep this up. They're out of manpower already, which isn't good. The Steel Rangers have lost a little bit more manpower. That's good to see. The Washington Brotherhood has lost quite a bit of man... 5,000 man... 2? What? What's going on? 4? Oh. Oh, boy. Tribal Scout Kits. Very good. Very good. Let's go ahead and grab some more vehicle stuff first. Because we're going to need to go to war to get more army XP, which... We're expecting quite the struggle. Yeah, you got a lot of divisions, guys. That's uh, that's good. You got some cars. That's very cool, very cool. They stopped the attacks for now, or at least they stopped letting New Mariposa push. Yeah, seeing what's going to happen here is going to be very interesting. Uh, do we have radar down here? That'll be important to have. Yes, New Vegas, good. Because I want to see what's going on the entire time. Kaiser, you're just not doing well whatsoever. You're out of manpower, that explains it. A lot of divisions, but you're out of manpower, which is totally not good. So, new, new Mariposa. Brotherhood War. 4,000, 6,000. Almost no losses compared to these guys. That's insane. That's nuts. And when you go to war soon, by September 22nd. Which is fine. Whatever. Mm, our combat robots are looking pretty darn decent. I oh, got a little su surplus right now. That's good. APCs, we even have surplus of you. Let's go ahead and switch these guys out to get some armored annihilators. Um, more reliability, I guess. A little more attack. Nah, we don't have that much air XP. That'll be good enough. Good. Can I convert these? There's no. Uh, you can't really convert them. The defenses are online. And we get a bonus to Special Forces Doctrine and other stuff. Cool. Uh, let's do this one next. Restore dug way proving ground. Sell some outdated equipment. Supply line 2. Get a better... Opinion gives 3.5% discount. We get some pistols. Eh, it's alright. Before we go to war. I want to core Nixon. Thank you. Less resistance. A little bit more manpower. Great, so... When they go to war with us, we're going to take quite a beating, I think. Ooh, these guys are over here. Yeah, maybe you guys are training. Okay. You know what? How about everyone stop training? I don't trust Heaven's Gate. I really don't. I really don't. 
An alarming trend, national sentiment is beginning to rise in one of our subjects. Words like self-determination, freedom, and liberty are being spoken by powerful figures in New Hammond far too often for our liking. If we don't do something about this now, the sentiment may get out of hand. Squash them? Uh, go ahead and squash them, that's fine. We got enough political power. Another APC, great. Hmm. Honestly, if they, like, get freedom, I really don't care. Like, that's probably what I'm, that's what I'm expecting, so. Colony, you know, whatever. Whatever. Uh, come on. And... So we're going to build up these... Well, these guys are pretty much already built up. And we'll use them until they're, we really can't. Armored Annihilators. Yes, please. And let us go ahead. I don't know what's going to happen. You're all in attack. Yeah, I just let you all do this region. Alright, man. Please stop that. You know, honestly, this is a ton of manpower. This is just a ton of manpower. Oh, what do they have? Resistive. Oh, we got the separate done too. Great. Attack defense on core territory. That's so not good. <clears throat> Majority slave workforce. Monthly population. They got a lot of attack. That's not good. So we're going to go to war with these guys. Are they going to fight us first? No. What happens if we try to push into their lands? I'm a little apprehensive. But we could try it. Especially with air support. We can do fairly okay. So... I'm feeling good about this so far. This probably won't last very long because they, they also have divisions over here as well. But this is a little concerning as the Brotherhood is slowly taking over Kaisar's Legion. That's a massive army we're going to have to fight. That's huge. Oh, another APC. Great. Uh, throw you right here. Oh, no. Or right here. Alright, guys. Please stop sending me stuff. That's very not cool. And, oh, we can't clamp down on autonomy yet. Uh, we can help the settlements. How much manpower do we get a month now? We get 274 a month. That's pretty darn decent. We're still struggling a little bit in some areas. That's fine. It's always good to struggle a little bit, right? Oh, hold on. Antelope tribes. You're still my puppet, I think, right? Yeah, no. I called you to arms, boy. You go and respond. Call to arms. Not bad. Return rollers, more reliability. Let us grab a tank division. Great. Oh, Antelope Tribes. No, thank you. So far, what is the casualties like? We've lost 46 versus 12,000. How is the Brotherhood struggling this much? Or how am I doing this well? This makes no sense. I'm not calling these guys in just because I don't want them to get any more autonomy. High caliber ammunition. Sounds very good. Let's get some HMGs. Clamp I do want to clamp down on autonomy just a little bit more for now, too. That'd be nice. Mojave Brotherhood has joined our, as our ally. This will make the Mojave chapter extremely weak. Actually, with this peace deal, this is really going to ruin the manpower of the Brotherhood of Steel as well as the Mojave chapter, which is very good for us because we're going to need a lot of things to resist for resistance. But uh, we got a lot of manpower. Ooh, are we not? Ooh, maybe we want to stop attacking. Yeah, let's go ahead and stop moving. Defend to hell. Holy crap, they're attacking us with hardcore now. Which, uh, kind of expected, you know. Not gonna lie, I kind of expected this. Cool, cool, cool. Let's see, more research. Oh, looking pretty awesome. Let's grab. It's 209 days, whatever. More reliability, though. That's awesome. Mm, look at all this stuff. Travel scout kits. That sounds kind of, like, fun. Alright, so, we're doing okay here. You guys can move up, probably. Eight old bad lands. Uh, you could probably help support the attack in Bly. However you pronounce that, Bly. We've lost 108, they've lost 13,000, mostly pretty much all to us. And they're going to be attacking us like crazy. Hey, Vault 21, yes, thank you. This is why I kept them alive. Very good. Uh, you know what, build all this stuff up, that's fine. Do we need any air bases? We might eventually, so that'd be okay too. Oh, more, we got more military factories as well. Make a lot of rocket launchers. And when you're done making rocket launchers... We're making a few light machine guns. I think that would be okay. And then make... We can make more doggos. Do we have a scrap water? Yeah, we got plenty of scrap water. Do something like that. And what are we missing? Oh, close air support. That's fine. We're just going to use them up. Because these guys... That's going to be good stuff. They'll probably beat us in some locations. Can they pierce us? They probably can. Not. And sometimes. We can pierce them, though. Cool. Oh, sometimes they can pierce us, too. Which is, yeah. I really don't like. Yeah, now we're... Yeah, see, we're losing there. We're slowly losing in some of these locations, which is really, really not ideal. So hold them off as much as you can. Drain them of the resources, of course. That's the main thing. 
Anointed declared... Oh, wait. The anointed. All right. Lord's anointed. Good luck with that. We're losing a little bit here and there. Whatever. You know, whatever. Another APC. Great. So I want to get rid of these divisions eventually and swap to APCs. Uh, we have a sl small deficit of APCs. I need to ramp up production of more APCs, honestly. Lower production down here. There you go. Uh, that's not a really good thing to do. Whatever. I just need more APCs, man. Now they love attacking us. How much manpower do they have? Because we do have ciphers. I should have used, maybe used my cipher a little bit earlier. They're out of manpower. They have a ton of factories, but they're out of manpower. Less than 200 divisions. Their most common division has anti-tank, which is a real bummer. Real, real, real bummer. They could do an encirclement if they're smart. So this is the Troll Warren. Or really new Mariposa, so they might be a little smart. Uh, go ahead and clamp down on autonomy, that's fine. Go ahead and restore the Spanish Fork Armory, perhaps? Does it cost the same thing? Manpower, caps. Nice. Eh, do Fort Huachuaca, Huachuchuca. Air Station Fallon, good enough, that's fine, I don't really care. Someone falls ill, we'll get better. Uh, less stability from. Uh, you know, let's do that. We have 100% stability. We could probably suffer a little bit of the cost. We get defeated a little bit here and there, that's okay. It's definitely putting some damage on those guys, which is awesome. And ciphers. Spies? I forgot about my spies. I always forget my sp about my spies. You know what? Do two spies here, New Mariposa. Just because. I wonder if we have enough time to build up a collaboration government. We might not be able to. It's, it's hard to time it correctly. Uh, less weekly war support. That's really bad. Uh, how about we contact the boomers? I love the boomers. No such thing as a boomer remover. So, Vault 34 was abandoned by what became the boomers around 50 years ago, and they've inhabited Nellis Air Force Base ever since. They're severely distrusting of everyone, but with the grace of their leader, they've allowed a diplomatic mission to speak to them. Vault 34 itself, however, is suffering from a reactor leak and is inhabited by evil ghouls. We could either approach the boomers and give them control of the surrounding lands, giving us a powerful regional ally we share our origins with, or repair the server reactor leak, kill the ghouls, and secure the vault as an outpost in the area. Repair it? Oh, I I don't want the boomers. I just want to core them. That's really what I want to do. I just want to repair it. I don't want to bring the boomers alive. Um, please, I've got nothing against the boomers, but I prefer Vault City owning stuff. That's fine with me. Cool. Ah, oh, sorry boomers. No freedom for you. You had a chance. Ah, oh, beautiful. Yeah. Oh yeah, they're definitely pushing us back. Definitely. Even when they're, as they're running out of manpower. But we're pushing them back a little bit as well. You know, whatever. It, it's a give and take. So I'm not really frustrated with this at the moment. Just because I know what... I've readjusted ourselves ever since the battle for New Reno. With the capabilities of what uh, robots are capable of. Can I make it a small encirclement here? That'd be great. Yeah, if they want to leave, I mean, hey, by all means, leave. Come on. Come on, guys. Oh, why'd you let him escape? Come on. That's stupid. That's that's a big... That's that's a moment there, man. All right, so they've abandoned the line again for some reason. We've got some volatile fuels. We've got some environmental sealing for less max speed, but more recovery rate. I love the recovery rate. And you know what? A struggle here, a struggle there. It could be worse. It could be much worse. Dang, do we not even get to encircle someone here? You know what? Just go... You know what? They don't have a... No, they're stacking more divisions on here now. It says we can do well. This is probably a bad idea. This is probably a terrible idea. Let's do it anyways. Because we're running out of energy cells. Go, my boys. Go. More We have more breakthrough right now. Fling yourself at the enemy. Ooh, and I don't want to forget... Power stations. Uh, ooh, yeah. Vault 70. That's good stuff. That's some good stuff right there. 30. I haven't really developed this area too much. That'll be good. That'll be very good. Awesome. Keep going. We got plenty of breakthrough, even though you might not be getting a lot of it. Level 4, level 7, Nicholas. Awesome stuff. How are the APCs doing? Oh, you're just uh, hanging out? Throw you in the mix, man. How is Brotherhood? They've eh, it's kind of shifted a little bit. Okay, they've they're still taking out Khazar's Legion. 
We got kind of lucky. Uh, we're not really winning as much as I would like to. But the more we attack, the more losses we take, but the more losses they take. We've lost about a thousand. I mean, this is a huge enemy. This is a massive enemy. Where they really can't replenish what they have, I think. I could be wrong. No manpower? Look at all those resources. We want those resources. Man, we can't even win here anymore. That sucks. Uh, you know what? Just hold for now. Even if you think you're winning, just kind of hold. They stocked up more on their uh, divisions, which is fine. Whatever. Uh, thank you. Cooling jacket. Manage subjects. No. No, you're going to come back down. Light machine guns. Very cool. And they're attacking me once again. This is a give and take. And, of course, Heaven's Gate's becoming pretty big. We'll probably have to take them out after this war is over. Uh, Western Brotherhood. I don't want to trade with you. Oh, yeah. That's not worth it. That's, that's not worth it. That's not worth it either. Antelope Tribes. Thank you. Composite materials with Steel Rangers. I'm not going to send four at a time. No, no, no. Tar walkers. Thank you. Two. No. No, 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 no. Build more power stations. That's great. Let them attack us. Let us get our guys to heal up a little bit more. And who are we deciphering? Heaven's Gate. Actually, you know what? Let's do this a little bit more. Machine assisted decryption. There you go. Actually. Oh, I need to be a faction leader or be in a faction, become a spy master. That's right. Yeah, that's right. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah. Hmm. We need more combat robots. APCs are, APCs are looking pretty awesome. Awesome. We can use some tanks. Uh, security team twos. No, no, no. Yes, daddy. Yes. More armor. I can make these even more armored. That might be worth doing. I don't have enough army XP for that. Whatever. Uh, put you under robots. It's probably a bad idea. Whatever. There you go. Once we repair enough stuff, you'll have that. Uh, robot APCs. You know what? I'm just going to start converting some of these guys just straight to, to straight APCs because they take so much less supply. You'll gain more robots. We got plenty enough to do this, so that'd be awesome. It helps supply just barely here. Just barely. That'll help supply hopefully a little bit as well as we build up our sauce more and more and more. They attack us, you know, whatever. We've done the most damage, so I'm not really concerned about it too much, actually. Look at all that space we have in New Vegas. So good. So good. Uh, resistance stuff. We have Aslan. Mexico's probably going to become a little nicer to look at. That'll be okay. 192 divisions. 35. Okay. And let's take a look at this tank template. So, they are 20 combat width with 4 tanks. Armor is pretty darn decent. Until I put on some of this. Their organization isn't bad. HP is a little low. I don't like how low it is. If I made it like this, they have enough organization. They have enough HP. Their armor goes up by 4. This doesn't look too bad. Supply is pretty bad, though. Uh, we're going to need a lot for this. I'd like more stats. Like, if we remove, like, 1... I don't think we can throw in a tank. Yeah, because it's 41 combat width, so it's, it's whatever. This will be fine. Go ahead and throw on some just the companies. And then we'll do some stuff with Ghost Guards. Not Ghost Guards, but um, resistance stuffs. Awesome. Blimps. I can do blimps. What is this? Oh, more range? Yeah, that's, that's worth doing. Getting more range. That's always good to do. Explore Vault 19. How about that? So Vault 19 was the site of an experiment in social separation, separating the Vault Dwellers into two separate groups. The experiment failed, however, due to a huge sulfur deposit that contained contaminated their air supply. Uh, te demo technology and five scrap, or we just get a core. You know me. I'm just going to blow the sulfur and establish a settlement. I, the less resistance in my mind is just, it's you can't be, you can't beat it. No resistance down there would be amazing. Oh, look at that. Mm. Vault 19. Perfect. Alright, so their uh, new mirror pose is actually spreading down a little further, in my opinion, in the Western Brotherhood. Look how weak they are. That's beautiful. That's just beautiful. They're out of manpower, which is good. Brotherhood's got 6,000 more manpower. They must have raised their conscription level, which I don't understand why I can't see the conscription level of anyone. And yeah, we don't have the no, perfect intel on these guys, but ours is better than nothing, right? 
At least I would hope so. But you know what? This episode has gone on long enough, and I think we've been pretty darn successful. We took out New Vegas. Of course, we finished off New Reno. We took New Vegas. We established a new puppet here that might be able to give us stuff. Maybe, maybe not. Kaiser is dying to the Brotherhood, which is not doing well against New Mariposa, but we're doing well against them. But anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed today's episode. If you did, consider leaving a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below, and I will see you all tomorrow as we will take out New Mariposa. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.